Last week we used the registers to manage compliance with new legislation. But if you don't believe that entering a record against every building in your portfolio is a good use of your time, you're not alone. That's why in today's tip, we look at using the compliance wizard to allocate a compliance type to multiple plans at once. Using the compliance wizard is especially useful if you want warnings to appear on the corp window or on work orders and quote requests. So we'll set up a new compliance type where that'll be especially useful, such as recording heritage listed buildings. Tick the checkboxes if you want warnings to appear and put a message that will appear on all quotes and work orders for the selected buildings. Once you've got the compliance type configured, go to the wizards menu and select compliance register. Select the compliance type from the drop-down menu and a list of strata plans will be displayed. Highlight the applicable plans and click the Add button, then click the Apply button to process. That's all there is to it. The selected plans now have that compliance type registered against them. Well, maybe it's not all. The wizard applies the compliance, but only the basic information. So if you need to record anything specific, make sure you go into the register itself to update the details. And that's all there is to it. Except for the warnings, that is. Since we selected the warnings to appear on the corp window, any plan with this compliance type will show a warning here. And because we selected a warning on repairs and maintenance, we'll also see a warning here. Great for reminding strata managers to specify to tradies what they can and can't do. And last but not least, the message we set up will show automatically on any quotes or work orders that are sent. Or should I say automagically? We are talking wizards after all.